All right, I get asked this question all the time, and it's basically how often should you see a guy when you first start dating? Because you don't want to come on too strong, yet you don't want to like not show enough interest, so he basically goes, well, this girl isn't for me. In this video, I actually give you a strategy and a guideline on how often you should see a guy when you first start dating. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm Renee Slansky. I'm a professional dating and relationship coach. This is just basically a new segment that I'm starting where I want to answer some of those common dating questions that are given to me so I can just tell you girls what you should do so that you can cut through the confusion. And one of those common questions is how often should you actually see a guy? Should you see him once a week, twice a week, three times a week, and for how long? The important thing that you need to understand here that setting the pace in uh, the beginning of a relationship, so when you're getting to know someone, is really important because it does two things. Number one, it actually gives you time and perspective to get to know someone's character. And number two, it actually makes them want to pursue you even more. My rule of thumb is actually this. If you are dating someone, then you should only see them once a week for the first four weeks, okay? What this does is it means that you've got time enough to be able to plan dates so that you've got something to look forward to and get excited about. It gives you, again, an indication of whether or not he's going to continue to invest in you because he can't see you every single uh, day or a few times in one week. And a good month of only seeing each other once a week, so that's four times in one month, really helps you work out, again, is this person invested and what do I actually know about them? Those first four dates should be really casual dates. So they shouldn't be going back to each other's houses in between there or doing things overly familiar and intimate. Ladies, if you want a guy to pursue you and woo you, but not only that, you want the right man with the right intentions, then you can't rush this process. You have to understand that even if he's really keen on you and he wants to speed things up or get intimate really soon, it doesn't mean that you should. And this brings me to my free webinar that I have for you girls. It's all about understanding the three common mistakes that we make in dating and the three shifts we need to make to really set ourselves up to attract and build a healthy dating life, which then leads to a healthy relationship. Now, that's what I suggest that you should be doing in the first month. Then obviously, as you start to get to know each other over the second or third month, you can increase the amount of time that you could be seeing that person. At the end of the day, girls, it's about investment. How much are they investing into you is an indication of how much you should invest back. And not only that, who is investing into me? Is this person good for me? Does this person want the same things as me? What is their character like? That is just as important to ask yourself as well as how often I should see this person. Hope that that helped you. You can get the access to the free webinar in the link down below. In the meantime, don't forget to subscribe. Give me a thanks, Renee, in the comments if this video has helped you and good luck. I will see you soon.